Hello everyone, Heinlein here. In this video I will go uh, through the cold startup uh, procedure in the MiG-21. This uh, aircraft is very Russian, so it's a lot of uh, switches uh, to do simple things, but uh, once you get a hang of it, it's uh, quite uh, easy and you can get this uh, thing airborne in uh, like a minute or so. So, let's get uh, right through it. Uh, you start up with uh, putting on uh, the inverter switch and the uh, battery heat, like so. Next up you uh, turn on the battery power, uh, the DC generator and the AC uh, generator for ground power. Next up uh, you turn on the three fuel switches. You can hear they are starting uh, up. Uh, I don't know if you can, how cl clear you can uh, hear it over the recordings, but uh, I can at least. Next up we turn over to the left hand side and uh, we turn on the engine APU switch, the fire extinguisher and we uncage the throttle I have it uh, key binded so at this point uh, make sure the switch is to normal start and press the starter button for about 5 seconds and you can hear the engine uh, comes to life now you can see it and uh, the engine uh, start switch is lighting up and you can see the engine is uh, spooling up. It takes a couple of seconds to uh, for the engines to spool up. So at this point the engine is uh, idling, so uh, now we can uh, turn on uh, the engine cone switch, uh, the pump unit switch, the tr trim system switch, uh, and all these switches right here. You don't need this one, but... And uh, all the weapon system switches uh, for electrical power. And you can turn on some external light, sorry, some external uh, lightning, it's daylight, so I go to bright and uh, turn on the gun sights and the camera and the IFF system okay and then we can turn on the gyros right here three of them and you can now you can see the gyros are uh, starting to spin and, and then you press the uh, FTS uh, switch to uh, uncage everything So, uh, next up you can uh, turn on uh, your radar, uh, this one uh, is optional because the uh, radar takes like uh, takes about 3 minutes to warm up if I remember it uh, correctly but um, the radar in the MiG-21 is uh, cooled with alcohol, vodka as a matter of fact, uh, very typical Russian and uh, uh, it only has enough cool coolant for about 40 minutes uh, of operations in standby mode and uh, uh, 20 minutes in the up in uh, the on position. So you need to take that into consideration before you are uh, departing. So for the next thing, I like to turn on the ATC system and uh, the RWR. And also, uh, don't forget to uh, turn on uh, your uh, HUD, like so. These two switches, right here. This one is for the paper, and this one is for the fixed net. And at this point you can configure your aircraft for your uh, mission, if you're going air-to-ground, uh, air-to-air, and select the relevant weapon stations, and make everything as ready as you can before the mission starts. And. Uh, Right now you are ready to taxi. All you need to do is to uh, turn on the taxi lights, like so. And of course, do not forget to close your canopy. Uh, I have the standard key binding, uh, right control and Charlie, like so. And uh, lock it up and pressurize. 
So at this point you are ready to taxi and thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video where I will go through the taxi and takeoff procedure in the MiG-21.